your first alert weather with meteorologist Darren Stack. A little bit of a warmer Tuesday out there for us with a little more sunshine as well. Overall, we're calling for a mixture of sun and clouds this afternoon and high temperatures climbing to 77 in Myrtle's Inlet, 78 in Myrtle Beach and North Myrtle Beach away from the coast, even topping out in the low 80s with Florence, Marion, Lumberton and Darlington maxing out at 82 Conway at 80 degrees. There will be the slight chance for a few showers, even isolated thunderstorms this afternoon as well as tonight. Better chance for scattered showers and thunderstorms will be coming in with this cold front that will be moving through the area overnight Wednesday to early Thursday. The better chance for those showers and thunderstorms, though, will be for your Wednesday afternoon and Wednesday evening. Behind that front, nice and dry conditions will be moving in. A little bit of a cooler air mass, but that will also drop the humidity for us as well and bring back the sunshine for the end of the week and even into the upcoming weekend. As far as our rain chances go today, few and far between 20% chance along the coastline, 30% chance expected for the inland areas, mainly west of I-95. As we go overnight, we'll hold on to that slight chance. Otherwise, partly to mostly cloudy skies will be around with us. And then we go through your Wednesday, mainly dry early in the day, but scattered showers and thunderstorms pushing in from west to east as we go through the late morning and in through the afternoon. We'll hold that chance as this is a very slow moving cold front to come through here. We'll hold that chance overnight into early Thursday morning. By Thursday daybreak, though, as you can see, all of the rain is off to our east. Skies are beginning to clear out for us. Aside from a few wraparound clouds for your Thursday afternoon, Thursday still looks like it's going to be a dry day for us. On Wednesday, though, with that front coming into the area, we do have a slight risk. We could see some severe weather out there. Our primary threat would be damaging wind gusts. It could even see some hail. We'll keep an eye on that for you. It's a low risk nonetheless, but we'll keep an eye on that for you. Make sure you're uh, logged on and signed up for Alert 15 and 15 weather call so we can get that information sent to your mobile device if you are not near your computer or television. Otherwise, your Grand Strand 7 day forecast after that front moves through on Wednesday looks pretty good. If you ask me, mid to upper 70s for your highs, lows in the middle and upper 50s. Just a few extra clouds coming in by the end of the weekend and beginning of next week. But dry conditions still in the forecast, even for the inland areas from Thursday through Monday. Slight chance of a shower or thunderstorm out there today. Again, mainly the better chances staying west of I-95. 70% chance of those scattered showers and thunderstorms out there for the day tomorrow. A few strong thunderstorms certainly in the mix, and then we see the highest staying around that 79 to 80 degree mark from Thursday through Sunday. A great looking extended forecast, plenty of sunshine, comfortable conditions, certainly the part of the forecast I'm looking forward to. Hopefully you are too, and if you need some rain, hopefully you'll get some either later on today, tonight, or at some point during the day on Wednesday. So we'll keep you updated on that Wednesday forecast. Have a great Tuesday, and remember you could always get your latest news and weather updates on your website, carolinalive.com.